As the legal landscape changes, the way lawyers work and conduct business is evolving and legal office spaces are starting to reflect this. With reduced individual offices, open concept office layouts, and increased meeting spaces, offices are starting to reflect a culture where collaboration is fostered and the flow of ideas is open. An open concept office of any type, regardless of the type of company, I think affords a certain level of um, bonding and uh, idea exchanges and the ability for people within that space to really have chance encounters with one another. Um, but the open space certainly allows for a free flowing of ideas and also just makes the culture more vibrant. If people feel that others are around and accessible, they're more likely to involve them um, in a way that if you're just sitting in your office, you know, you might think, well, I'll just do it myself. Whereas if you're bumping into people more often through the physical space, it, 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 it tends to be a constant reminder of the, of the fact that you're not alone, that you've got other people who can provide insights that, that you might not have. Offices such as Caraval Law Toronto and Deloitte's Toronto headquarters, where their in-house legal team practices, have additional features to their spaces, like treadmill desks, to promote employee health. Deloitte's legal team doesn't even have fixed desks. The thought of having an office to come to every day, quite frankly, is now depressing to me. I think the main thing is that there's a lot of movement and collaboration between my lawyers and staff and also with the client. None of us with fixed office space or a place to work, we're finding places to work and that results in a different movement of people connecting and working on problems, finding solutions to problems. Without fixed desks, the company provides a storage drawer to each employee that's electronically passcode protected. As for privacy, the facility provides enclosed phone booths and temporary closed-in offices and meeting areas when needed. Well, I mean, just the whole variety of different ways to work. Uh, there are different things that lawyers do during the course of a day. So, if I'm reading a factum, I'm probably sitting on a couch or in a private area reading. Uh, if I'm uh, on a conference call, I might be in a small room or a telephone booth or at my desk uh, because it's set up so that we can talk on our uh, headsets in a way that uh, you're not, people aren't listening in on what you're saying. We're, we are much more productive uh, because of the ability to adapt um, the workplace to how we feel about working at that particular time. According to the Law Society of Upper Canada, there are no restrictions in the lawyer's rules of professional conduct or paralegal rules of conduct prohibiting working in an open office environment, as long as privacy requirements are met. Gordon Ladner Gervais' Toronto office may have fixed desks with some private offices, but their mainly open concept space still operates similarly with increased client and lawyer meeting spaces, closed in private meeting rooms, and reduced private office sizes. We've got uh, people in much more open plan offices so that there, there's more, it just feels like you can see people, it's more of a feeling of a team around. We've got a number of huddle spaces where people can get together to collaborate in a way that we did, weren't able to before. I think all told we've added about two-thirds more meeting rooms apart from offices from our old space. This industry must change uh, and whatever we can do to, sh to show the world uh, this is what a 21st century law firm should physically look like. Uh, we're happy to be at the forefront and, and, and be part of that. I just believe that this is the way law will be practiced in the future and I think uh, earlier adopters of it will figure out where those issues are that they need to fix and uh, they're all fixable and, and it's really the way uh, things will be done in the future. For Canadian Lawyer, I'm Alexia Kapralos. Thank you.